Uh, I thought today's presentation was very helpful and informative to a lot of our students who don't necessarily listen to like teachers when we say some of the same things, but hearing from someone who has experience, I think, might resonate with some of them, maybe not today, but hopefully like in the near future. Yeah, I agree. I think that sometimes when they're getting it from their parents all the time, or they're getting it from teachers, or you have some kids who have never touched it before, and so they're all telling them not to do it. Um, once you have someone who has experienced it and lived through uh, some of the major struggles that comes with it, um, it kind of puts it more in perspective of uh, what could happen um, and what possibly will happen um, to uh, some of the ones that are experiencing it now. Yeah, I think that a lot of the kids like understood him and um, kind of understood where he's coming from and probably relate in some some ways um, with some of the things that he's gone through. I think a lot of them can do that. Uh, I think he knows how to talk to kids. Uh, he uses some of the lingo. He uses some of the words that they know that sometimes teachers don't know. Mm -hmm. um, and so when he presents himself in a way that is relatable to them, uh, he he draws them in and he grabs their attention from the beginning. Um, I also really love how vulnerable he is in the very beginning, yeah. uh, telling his full story so that um, people realize like, okay, I want to listen to him and I want to listen to what he says. Um, and then he hits them with the, the truth because he said, um, uh, we're all being lied to and it's true. Uh, as a teacher, I feel like it gives me just more information that I didn't know um, because I feel like I don't know a lot of the things that he was talking about. I'm like, I've never even heard of some of this stuff, but this is a normal thing in kids' life. So I think as a teacher, it helps me just to have kind of more information that I can share with them and hopefully help them to be like the safe place for them, like you talked about, to, hey, I don't want to, I don't want to use this jewel anymore. I don't want to smoke or drink or whatever the case is, um, and they can come to me for guidance. Uh, we're both PE teachers, and as PE teachers, we want to know everything about our health. And I do understand that a lot of times we don't know some things because they're hidden from us. Um, and so when we're not given the information, we can't present it. And so this motivates me to learn more and to discover more about some of the things that are hidden from us yeah. on purpose so that we can continue to share it with our students.